Night Circus Nail Art Tutorial by Hot Pink Zebra Polish. Begin by painting your pointer, middle, and ring nails black and your thumb and pinky nails red. On your pointer nail, we're going to begin by painting the silhouette of the man on the cover of the book. So we're going to start by painting a circle for his head. And then above that circle, we're going to be giving him a hat. And then paint his neck. And then we're going to be painting a shoulder and his body below. And then paint his arm coming up, and so it's tipping his hat towards the woman that we'll be painting on our ring nail. And paint the cuff of his sleeve, and then his hand going up and lifting up his hat. And now if you have any mistakes anywhere, you can touch these up with black paint. Otherwise, add two little dots for buttons on his sleeve, and then fill in a triangle on his chest. And now on our ring nail, as I mentioned, we're going to be painting the silhouette of the woman on the front cover. So I'm going to begin with her hat at the, near the top of my nail. And then paint the rim of that hat. And then paint her hair at the back. And then the silhouette of her face. And with all these shapes, if you need to add a second coat, um, you should do that before you go through and add any of the details with black. So then paint a shoulder below and then the other shoulder. And then she's wearing this long red scarf, so add the scarf on her neck. So now you'd want to add a second coat before doing those touch-ups like I'm doing now. And then she's got this little frill on her hat, so add that with black, and then some polka dots on her coat. So then fill in her scarf with red paint. And on then on your middle nail, we're going to be painting a tent. So I'm going to start with a triangle that's got its two lines sort of curved toward the middle. So they're not straight lines, they're a little bit curved. And then take the corners of those lines and curve them down to the outer tips of your nail. And above that, I'm just going to be painting a little flag on top. So now once we have that outer shape all perfect, we're going to be going through and painting some stripes. So I'm going to start and I'm going to create a stripe on the outside edge. And then just take and create a little triangle coming down. And then you want to have an angle, so you don't want your stripes to just go straight down. You want them to look as if they're falling over the edge of the tent. And then you can touch up your flag with just a little bit of black paint if your lines need to be fixed or if you need to straighten anything or fix anything. It's easy to do with black paint when you're painting on black nails. And then on your thumb and pinky, we are going to be painting a clock. So start by painting a white circle in the middle of your nail. And on this pinky nail, it's a little bit too close to my cuticle. It does still work. It's okay. but 
you want it to be a little bit closer to the center of your nail. And then we're going to be going through and we're going to be outlining our circle with a thick black line. So basically we're just adding another ring around that circle. And then we're just going to be painting two little lines that come to a point around the middle for the hands of the clock. And then right where those two lines come together, add a red dot. So now there's gray swirls going around this clock, so we're going to be painting. This is just like the outside shape of them, because then we're beginning to be adding little details with black to make them look like swirls. But add the two at the top and then two on each side. So then, as I mentioned, we're going to be defining these swirls with black paint. So start by just adding little details to the top, and then have a little swirl in the center of the ones on the sides. And of course, add a layer of top coat. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like my design. Please comment with requests and subscribe. Also check me out on Facebook and Twitter. I will see you in my next video.